Oh, so we're doing the old intro again? Okay. Uh, welcome to Probably Impeccable Picks Week 2, a place where we got uh, a little political last week, which has led people to ask me, Kyle, who are you voting for? Well, I'll tell you who I'm voting against, Mayor McCheese. He has been far too lenient on the Hamburglar for far too long. I mean, think of the victims, Mayor. I before we move on to the picks, I want to take a quick look at our football prediction standings. First, I'll show you the final standings from last season. Okay, that's very nice. And now, the current standings after week one. Huh. huh. Look at that. Um... All right, let's pick some games here. We'll start in the Colonial League, Northwestern at Salisbury. I did something that I normally never do last week. I picked against Northwestern, and I paid for it. But at least I didn't go to Northwestern and pick against Northwestern like some people. Shameful. Tigers win. Next, we'll move on. Easton at Liberty. Uh, do you remember what I just said about not picking against your alma mater? <laughs> I'm uh, picking Easton. So, um, eh? we'll switch back to the Colonial League quickly. Saucon Valley at Penargel on the hill. Uh, first of all, I just want to say I know I made a mistake in our fabulous football tab regarding where Penargel was going to play its week one game. You can stop sending your letters. I made a mistake. I'm not perfect, okay? Uh, second of all, I'm picking Saucon Valley this week. So will I be wrong about Penargel again? Maybe. All right, next up on the list, Whitehall at Emmaus. This is a father-son tag team Clash. In one corner, you have Matt Seneca, the Emmaus offensive coordinator, and his father, Sam Seneca, the defensive coordinator. In the other corner, you have Zach Gilbert and his dad slash head coach, Brian Gilbert. This is like Cowboy Bob Orton and Randy Orton versus Dusty Rhodes and Gold Dust. And you might say, Kyle, that's kind of a weird reference. Well, it's not a weird reference when someone bets you $5 that you can't get a Gold Dust mention into one of these videos. Cash money, baby. I can be bought and sold, apparently. Um, what was I talking about? Oh, uh, Whitehall wins. Last but not least, Parkland at Nazareth. Now, um, I've already picked all the way teams so far, and I don't really need any more logic than that to pick Parkland. This isn't rocket science, people, but it is the end of our week two video. Thank you for watching, and please enjoy your Labor Day hurricane.